All right. Last time we finally found that woman living outside the stalight, Leona, and heard a whole lot more backstory about the initiates, the well of light, the tomb, everything. Plus, Archon drank some special water to drive back the infection a bit. So now it's time to head back to the Stalite and see if we can find some clues on how to get into that fabled tomb. Better put on the helmet. Back into the diving suit and back into the water. The obvious next course of action I have to take is using that key I assembled to enter the secret room in Real Sadar's house. But that's again one of those events that triggers quite a lot of other interesting stuff in the game. So I want to have some things taken care of before I actually do that. Contraption's too heavy. Got to take it off. Ugh. I can finally breathe. Might it, might, while I'm here, I might as well take a look at the jail cells again. It looks like not quite all of the conchlites are dead. Hey, you're not gonna let me rot in this cell, are you? Quiet. Vermin. Well, any enemy of the Conchalites has to be a friend of mine. Hey! Where did you come from? Let's take care of this squealing little guy. Nice going, buddy! Hey, didn't I just see this guy chained up underwater? I'm pretty sure he's not supposed to be here. I'm gonna get you out of there. At least not anymore. Hey, thanks, buddy! Think you can manage? Gah, it's solid, all right. Try to find a way to pick the lock. Well, technically, I can break open the lock with pretty much any weapon. But let's use something fitting. I'll get the cell open with that. Hey, thanks, man. I owe you one. Yeah, you do. And uh, whoop. Uh, oh, so apparently letting this guy out causes the game to crash. I'm pretty sure that didn't happen in my old game when I played it, but it must be something about playing on a modern system. Hey, let me out, scum! For the record, I tried Quiet. it several times and it keeps happening. So... Hey, where did you come from? So I'm afraid this guy is gonna have to stay in a cell. Nice going, buddy. But I feel bad about that, so I think I'm gonna put him out of his misery. This hurts you more than it does me. Eh, doesn't have anything on him. All right. As I remember it, the guy in the jail cell is one of Armal Sadak's men. And if you free him here, Armal Sadak later thanks you for that. So I think that if, like me, you caused Armal Sadak to no longer want to play young with you, freeing this guy from a jail cell will improve his disposition towards you and make him want to play against you again. Unfortunately, I can't show it off.
Uh, well, how about it? Wanna play a game? Maybe later. I can't help but try. Still have so many weapons that I don't need. Well, while I'm here, I might as well heal up all the way with stole and fill all my gourds. I'm gonna head back to Dan Reason. Show him that strange object that I found in the bunker. See if he knows what I can do with it. There you are. Dan Reese. I can't I really hear wish you. you wouldn't have to do Let this so many turn times. Off the grinding wheel. All right. Ah, the calm after the storm. Let's see if he knows anything about this crazy thing. You know what it is? An object from before. There's a weird substance inside. You should show it to Bogdoran, the master oiler. Okay, I can do that. I also show him the block of crystal. I found this stone outside. Rock crystal? Thanks. What, you're not gonna give me anything? Well, I no longer need a fake key piece, man, so... Me. Things could get very dangerous around here. It's more than just the darkness. There's another one. Another changed one, like me, Thanandar. It's because of him I'm contaminated. He... He, he wants to destroy the entire Stalite, and it's already started. So watch out, my old friend. I... yes, all right. Don't worry, I'll be careful. With the darkness, everyone's afraid. Armal Sadak's men are ready for war. If things get ugly, I'm sure they'll help me. All right. Kali, you're all I've got. I don't want to risk losing you. Whatever you say. I'll wait here, but be careful. Promise you'll wait for me here. I promise. She will, this time. All right, up to the upper city. Time to pay Bokran another visit. First, I want to make sure Lori and Fedori are still safe. Halt! Who goes there? Jazda, it's me, Arkan. Don't you recognize me? Arkan, yes. It is you. By the Sun God. Captain Fedoria warned us. But. I didn't think it was this bad. Stand aside. Lori sent me. Go on in. We were expecting you. Thank you. In memory of Archon. Guardian of fire. I didn't really want to go in. I just like hearing him say that line. Always brings a tear to my eye. Anyway, enough sentimental stuff, let's go see Bogdran. See if the weaselly little penguin can help me. There's the fat fella. Master Euler, 
You know the secrets of oils and the mysteries of alchemy. You must know of a cure for the sickness that's eating away at me. Uh, I... I'd like to help you, but I don't know anything about your disease. The Sunseer healers are the only ones with the power to help you. This is just an old line that I still needed to trigger. Now let's get to this object. Master Euler, I found this. It comes from the ruins of before. Do you know what it is? Hmm. It looks like part of it is broken. If you leave it with me, maybe I could take a look at it. All right. Here, take it. Good. I'll figure out what it is. Well? What is this stuff? Give me time to study it first, all right? Come on, go hang out somewhere else! All right, we'll uh, apply the tried and true method of walking out of the room and then stepping back in. Master Euler, please analyze this weird stuff for me. Listen, I should know a great deal more very soon. But first, I need your help. Oh. In all this chaos, I greatly fear for someone's life. A woman, Delia. You'll find her in the lower city, at the Silver Reed. It's a cabaret. A cabaret, sure. Please, bring her back here to me. When Delia stands safely at my side, I'll tell you everything you want to know about this relic from before. Nobody ever does anything for nothing in video games. Uh, all right. Now we have to go all the way back to the lower city. So I'll skip over that trip. And then and go pick up this guy's favorite stripper. Well, this place is awfully quiet. Which means I can finally get behind the bar and and pick up that slice of meat I've had my eyes on. Nice. Well, I hope Dilly is still alive. Yeah, so far so good. A little music box. She still looks pretty frightened of me. Don't be afraid. Bogdoran sent me. Bogdoran? Where is he? Up there in the upper city. I'm gonna take you to see him. Okay. I'll go with you. But you might want to throw on some clothes first. Really? No? Yeah. Great sun god, Maor! <laughs> ah, well. I don't really regret doing this. Wow, he's pretty tough. Maor wasn't himself. He was a beast. Trust me, I'm still human. Alright, let's keep going. Nothing interesting to find on him, so I'll leave him alone. We must return to the upper city. Come on. I'm right behind you, Arcan. Now the easy and obvious way to do this would be to have Delia follow you into the secret passage that leads into Dorkin's office. Unfortunately, she refuses to go in there. If you try to go into the secret passage, she says she'll wait for you there. So, you have to take the elevator. And why? Well, let's find that out. These monsters are here. They must be everywhere. I have to find the tomb. I must bring back the light. Well, looks like one guy's still alive. Hey, can you hear me? Hold on. Too late. They're here. Too strong. Nothing I could do. The dark shroud. Forever. I think we'd better hurry. Arcan! Over there! Yikes! A creature!
creature from the Darklands. What? What are we going to do? Don't worry. I'll take care of him. Don't move, whatever you do. Well, this guy is definitely big enough to warrant using my flamethrower. Finally a chance to see it in action. It's a bit tricky to aim with it, but it does do splash damage. Oh, damn it! Splash damage also hurts you, by the way. Huh, well, it was an indirect shot, but uh, at least it killed him. Wow, this, this guy looks bad. Alright, we're nearly there. to bring me here? How considerate, darling. Oh, please. Have you examined the relic from before? Huh? What? The object from before. Yes, yes, that's very weird stuff you've got there. This bar inside here, I'm not exactly sure what it is. But you shouldn't get it wet. I've covered it with Ruig oil, but be careful. It's still very dangerous. Why did you put oil into the relic from before? You see the green bar in the middle? I poured one little droplet of water on it, and it spit out enough flames to burn my beard. Oil, on the other hand, is neutral. It's safer like this. Does anyone remember me having this thing in my pocket while I was going through an underwater tunnel? I guess not. I'm glad I managed to bring you back. Many thanks, Arkan. May the great Solar watch over you. Hmm. The more I look at you, the better I understand Bogdaran. I hope one day you'll come back here to dance. Just for me. I'm grateful for what you've done, Arkan. And if the Sun God is willing, one day, I'll prove it to you. Uh, Archon, it... Isn't it about time you left? All right. Well, that's it for this one. See you in the next video.